Hello guys, welcome back to my reaction channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Avatar The Last Airbender episode 50 and 51. Last week we only got one episode because these, these episodes are supposed to be watched together. Last week I didn't have the time to give you a triple drop. Today I'm giving you the double drop or rather two episodes in one because it's that important for these episodes to be watched together. And I think I understand why because last episode they were about to invade the Fire Nation, aka the Fire Lord, because right there's gonna be an eclipse. But Azula and Zuko and the Fire Lord, they're low key ready because they know thanks to Azula our plans, right? So we're waiting for the Water Tribe to come here and so we can raid attack as well as the Earth Kingdom. So this is gonna be an all-out assault, right? And I still don't think what what's the Uncle doing? Like he's still in a cell training. Is he gonna bust out of there? Or what, what what is happening, right? Because he's still in a cell, but I guess uh, Zuko's doubting himself, but last episode, the Fire Lord embraced him, like, made him into his right-hand man, because he was sitting at the council, everybody greeted him, so he's welcomed again, but I still think they're manipulating the hell out of him, he can feel that he's not a part of the whole squad, but they're just pretending that he is, so... It's a whole messy, weird situation, but I'm here for it, I'm definitely here for it. Uh, Aang is... Uh, Aang, like, Aang was killed by Azula, let's not forget, he still has a scar to show it, right? If it wasn't for Katara and her special water, he would have been dead right now. And since he was killed in an Avatar state, all those Avatars, they're gonna be gone, bruh. Like, the cycle's not gonna continue, it, it, everything dies with Aang, bruh. So, Aang? Yo, you better, you better stop the Fire Lord. That being said, I ain't gonna pull on this that much. If you enjoy my reactions, feel free to share, subscribe, like, leave a comment, enjoy the Patreon, support your boy, Discord second channel. Let's go, man. And considering there's 10 more episodes after this, I think Aang is gonna fail. The invasion, yeah. It's gonna be a two-parter. The day of reckoning is here. <laughs> oh, they're back. Top of the morning, Momo. Sounds like you slept well. Like a baby? Yeah, he's rested. They're all back in their uh, wardrobe, right? E except Aang. I'm ready to face the Fire Lord. So what's your strategy for taking him down? That's dope. They're creating a little port for them. You made it, Dad! Were you able to locate everyone I told you to find? I did. But I'm a little worried, Sokka. Some of these the men swamp aren't exactly people. the warrior type. They're gonna... Ooh. So he had to hide his earthbending. Katara inspired me and my father to take back our village. You help so they're gonna bring everybody back. Everybody we met along the way is gonna be here to contribute and help in this upcoming invasion of the Fire Lord. We're bringing the fight to him. Definitely. Literally. Everybody that ever had a problem with the Fire Nation, they're gonna be here to contribute. Let us find our courage, Katara. Not bad. Now we're here to help you. No way. Is that... Hippo happy to see Blind Bandit! A new glider! This is amazing! And as a special feature, I added a new and improved. Oh, well, I'm <laughs> sure that'll come in handy. Today is the day of Black Sun, and I want to thank you all for your self-sacrifice and your courage. There are two steps to the invasion, a naval stage and then a land stage. Excuse me! The bold... So all the way through the Right, the capital, the main tower where the Fire Lord resides, all the way through, you're going to actually fight the Firebenders because they're going to have their abilities. And we're just saving the Eclipse for the actual Fire Lord because he's the strongest to give Aang an advantage. Everybody else is going to have to risk their lives. ...is confused. Isn't the point to invade during the Eclipse when the Firebenders it are powerless? The eclipse only lasts eight minutes. Okay, I thought they said six seconds. It's um, it's eight minutes. Eight minutes ain't bad. You can defeat a Fire Lord in eight minutes if he can't use his abilities, right? So eight minutes is an advantage. But they're going to have to fight every single other Firebender until they reach... Yeah, this is not going to be good. Not enough time for the whole invasion. And the Royal Palace is heavily guarded by Firebenders. And this war will be over. Yeah, but... Um, yeah, I just figured something out. <laughs> if Azula and the Fire Lord, they knew that, like, they know that they're coming, 
Isn't it like a way to destroy their plan just for the Fire Lord to hide somewhere? Like not even here. Like maybe he's in a fire. Maybe he's in a water nation somewhere hiding, right? Until the eclipse passes and then he returns. And then what you're going to do, right? What if he's not actually there? <laughs> like He can just evade you if he knows your plan. Literally, he can hide just. Wait for the eclipse to pass. Everybody getting ready. Ooh, Appa really did get his armor. Katara, you and the Swamp Benders whip up a fog cover. We'll sneak by them statues just like we sneak by that Fire Navy blockade. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're gonna find a random fog suspicious. They abandoned. No one's on board, sir. Where'd they go? Yeah. They can dive. What the? He created submarines? They're Lunch gonna have to resurface. Zero, Did he escape? No, he's time, still here. I brought you an extra bowl of rice. Thank you, Ming. Bro, You're... what is going on? My man is in a top, tip-top shape. What? What is he waiting for? I'm pretty sure he can bust out of here, but with his fire bending or whatever, and he's just here, looking like a freaking nomad, bro. Like looking like 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 a homeless person. What is happening? He, he must be planning something if he got back into shape. Oh, little gestures of kindness have made my days in prison bearable. I think you should take the rest of the day off. What? What if... What if I don't come back? Aang, don't say that. Of course you'll... Ooh. Oh, this ain't daydreaming, bro. My man went for it. Hey, yo! Now that's some chat energy right there. <laughs> what an exit. How are they gonna pass this gate? Oh, they saw them. How are you missing such a large target? <laughs> I got this one. Watch each other's backs. So is he gonna go free his uncle? That's what I want to know. The uncle mentioned th that that girl doesn't want to be here in the afternoon. How does that feel? Does he have a deal with Zuko or? Better. I need to get back to the troops. Charge! Badass with his new sword. Oh, Aang's already here. Yeah, I think it's obvious that he wouldn't be considering he knew about us coming. No, no, no! no. Fire Lord Ozai! Where are you? He's not here! I, I called it. I called it. It was such an obvious... It was such an obvious way for, for them to destroy our plans, right? But um, I can't really put anything against Aang and the others because they didn't know that they know, right? Azula overheard our plan without us, without us knowing that she overheard it. So, yeah, we, we had the element of surprise, but actually they had the element of surprise because now all they needed to do was hide, right, the important pawns, right? They probably left those soldiers in the beginning to lure them in. Now this is a trap for us. Because all they need to do is wait out the eight-minute eclipse and then invade from somewhere. And then we are going to be a sitting ducks, literally. This, this is diabolical, but I called it. I actually called it. <laughs> Let's continue. The Day of the Black Sun Part 2, the eclipse. Yeah, I'm telling you. The Fire Lord is going to hide until the eclipse is over. Please tell me you're here because the Fire Lord turned out to be a big wimp and you didn't even need the Eclipse to take him down? He wasn't home. No one was. Yeah. The entire palace city is abandoned. They knew. It's yeah. over. Oh, he's smart. My man, right away, they knew. 
yeah, he in a way he is a wimp. He dipped out of there. But I can't really call him a wimp. It's a smart strategy. Why would he give you what you want, right? He dipped out of there, and when he's at full power, he coming back. It's over. The Fire Lord is probably long gone, far away on some remote island where he'll be safe during the eclipse. Yeah. No. My instincts tell me he wouldn't go too far. Yeah. He would have a secret bunker, somewhere he could go and be safe during a season. Maybe he's still he'll here. Be close enough to lead his nation. Maybe. Is there a structure somewhere? There's something big, dense, and made of metal deep in the heart of the volcano. Sounds like a secret bunker to me. Can you bend it? But isn't this like a natural terrain for firebenders? Because there's literally lava here. They can lava bend probably, right? So this is like giving them an advantage. If Katara can blood bend, they can lava bend. The eclipse is only minutes away. We should be able to make it up the hill by the time it starts and secure the entire palace by the time it's finished. Prince Zuko, what are you doing oh, here? So he knows where the Fire Lord really is and he's going to betray him? He's going to attack him? He's going to fight him while he doesn't have his firebending? Or maybe not. What is he planning? Oh, this is interesting. I, I, at first, I thought he was sta standing in front of uh, the uncle's cell. But I guess not. Yeah, if Zuka attacks the Fire Lord, I think the Fire Lord is going to whoop his ass again. And then I think somehow the uncle is going to come here and save him uh, right, from his father and his brother, right? So, oh, this is going to be interesting. Man. Is this even at the same place? I feel like the Fire Lord is somewhere way, way, right? Not here. Why would she lie to me about that? Because the Avatar's not dead. He survived. What? In fact, he's probably leading this invasion. Good oh my god, I forgot about that shit, right? That's why he's so calm. Because they didn't reveal that little detail in Azula, and Zuko knew it this entire time. They told him about the invasion, but they kept the part where Avatar might be alive. That's why... The Fire Lord is so chill because he thinks it's just a normal invasion and he has the advantage because he knows about the invasion. He doesn't know that Aang is actually leading the invasion. You. That's another thing. I'm not taking orders from you anymore. You will obey me yeah. or this defiant breath will be your last. Hurting my feelings. Yeah, Stop. that's why he chose this time to speak to him like this, because there's not going to be firebending for the next eight minutes, which gives him enough time to speak his mind and dip out of there before his dad can burn his face some more, right? So that's very interesting. That's very interesting. But looks like they are at the same place. So it, this is in the same bunker, only at different quarters. Stop wasting our time and give us the information. You're powerless right now, so you're in no position to refuse. And stick to the truth. I'll be able to tell if you're lying. Are you sure? I'm a pretty good liar. For so long, all I wanted was for you to love me, uh. to accept me. I thought it was my honor that I wanted, but really, I was just trying to please you. You, my father, who banished me just for talking out of turn. My father, who challenged me, a 13-year-old boy, to an Agni Kai. How can you possibly yeah! justify a duel with a child? Yeah, he learned that you're not worthy of his love, bro. He finally understood that his uncle's his real dad, bruh. The uncle is actually the one who cares for him. The, the actually, he was actually the one who wanted the best for him. He was actually the one who's looking after him. And the dad still doesn't care. The dad is still a psychopath who does not care. He, he just, he doesn't care. Crazy, man. To do that to a 13-year-old child just for speaking out a term. Bruh, he's 13. Of course he's gonna speak out a term, bruh. He, 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 he barely hit puberty and you did that to his face? ...in history, and somehow the war was our way of sharing our greatness with the rest of the world. What an amazing lie that was. I'm giving it my all. Wasting! You're trying to keep yeah. us waste all our time! Um, right, I think your friend just said that, genius. And since you can't see, I should tell you, I'm rolling yeah. my eyes. I'll roll your whole head! Huh. She's just baiting you again. She was convinced you were going to come rescue her. Of course, you never came. And she gave up on you. 
Oh mm-hmm. my god, that's right. She defeated the girl that he likes, right? Uh, when Appa was... Right, she saved Appa. She released Appa and, and Azula caught her. That's why she was... She infiltrated the Earth Kingdom because they have the had the makeup of... I forgot, bro. I thought they, they just got defeated. So she actually captured them. And now she's somewhere here. A, a hostage. Yeah, okay. They have a hostage. <laughs> Oh, she's baiting you. Where is Suki? To you, my own son. And I was going to do it. Your mother found out and swore she would protect you at any cost. Where's Suki? Answer me! Sokka, she won't talk. Yeah, but that, that's the that's the thing. We don't know if he's lying or not, right? And even if that's the truth, that's even worse. Because instead of doing that to his face, he was supposed to kill him. That's even worse, bro. Like, Z- Zuko should just ignore him and go free his uncle first. Because his uncle has information as well. And his uncle would know if this was the truth or not. Where are you keeping her? Your mother did yeah. vicious treasonous things that night. She knew the consequences and accepted them. And now it's too late. Maybe it's not too late. The eclipse is over. True. But I can face the Fire Lord anyway. No. I don't think that's a good idea. What? But I'm ready. I came here with a job to do and everyone's no! on me. Hell no! If anything, this proved that you're not ready. You couldn't catch an unarmed, like, Azula. She couldn't even firebend. And she was running around, she was running circles around your ass. Sure, she knew that you were coming, but still, she was right there and four of you couldn't stop her. And you could bend too, bruh. Like, what the hell? Nah, fam, the Fire Lord is gonna kill you like just go away just just retreat regroup and then and, and figure something out the fire lord knew we were coming yeah. this time. we thought we had surprise on our side but we didn't what should we do Hakoda? oh you definitely will if zuko and his uncle are on your side <laughs> next time's gonna be crazy next time's gonna be crazy because zuko's gonna be fighting his sister right so she wouldn't be able to do this so that would leave the fire lord and ang to fight one-on-one now that now nah, we need zuko and i called it i said it this boy is either gonna be a horrible horrible adversary to overcome or he gonna join us one day and be, uh, play a pivotal role in us defeating the Fire Lord. Shouldn't something have happened by now? Are we gonna heal his know. face? I'm calling it. But now that the eclipse is Katara's over, I heal his face. we're going to see some firebenders any minute. My own invention. Oh, this is oh, terrible. Oh, and they stole that idea, right from the Earth Kingdom. They stole that idea. Not from the Earth Kingdom, from that uh, air temple, because uh, Sokka and that scientist defended the air temple by bombarding them with these balloons. And at the ending of one of those episodes, that one Fire Nation guy was like, hmm, this is going to be useful. This is going to prove useful. So they implemented that technology into their technology. And now they're going to catch us off guard. Crazy. That's a whole army. You're just... Special people, but still two people. Ooh, okay, that works. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. He was He's... like a one-man army. <laughs> He's strong as hell now. Yeah, he gotta help us. What do you wanna bet? You're our only chance in the long run. You and Sokka have to go with Aang somewhere safe. It's the only way to keep hope alive. The youngest of our group should go with you. The adults will stay behind and surrender. Bye, son. Bye, Dad. I'm really proud of you. Damn, so this is gonna be on the new generation. Because only the kids can climb Appa. Appa can carry all of them. And Appa's pretty much the only way now for us to escape. We should... Uh, uh, like, honestly, they should have commandeered one of those Fire Nation ships, balloons, whatever, and then escape like that. I'll miss you, Pipsqueak. Take care, the Duke. <clears throat> we'll be back for you, Dad. If we don't escape on our own first. <laughs> Thank you all for being so brave and so strong. I'm gonna make this up to you. You better find that monk so he can, can somehow open your chakras up. And... Oh, Zuko's following him. Interesting, so Zuko just determined to to help Aang but where's the uncle Ooh, now I want to know where the uncle is he busted out of there used all this commotion how is he gonna escape on foot 
He was a one-man army. My man buffed up, beat the shit out of everybody, bro. I love it. I love it. Like, he didn't even come to look for, for Zuko. I, I, I thought that he would come and help Zuko try to get him back to the right path. But no, looks like the uncle was... Nah, fam. He long gone, bro. The uncle lost faith in Zuko too and he just went on his own path. But somehow I think they're gonna end up in the same place. A.K.A. with Aang, right? Or maybe... We just find, found out that Zuko's mom might be alive and the uncle might know where she is. Maybe she, he's gonna go to her and then together they're gonna come find Zuko and try to convince him to change his mind and then be pleasantly surprised when, you, when they find out that Zuko changed his mind already and went on the right path to help Aang bring down his dad. That is crazy. But the way, the way uh, Zuko's dad was talking, he said that his mother committed a lot of treasonous acts that night so he doesn't kill Zuko only banishes him. I think she might have killed the previous Fire Lord or betrayed him, stabbed him in the back, some shit like that so he can get, right, she, she, uh, maybe, yeah, maybe she was supposed to be the next Fire Lord but no, 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 it was the uncle. The uncle, yeah, yeah, yeah. So she did something for with the current Fire Lord back then she got banished because treason and the uncle quit because his son died so the only one left was their dad to become the fire Lord. so that was the plan and that's why he spared zuko now he a horrible human being he he, he literally told zuko now i was supposed to kill you bro you should be you should be happy that i just banished you and gave that to your face nah bro he gotta go but that that was uh, i'm sad that they wasted this this opportunity this was a this was a good opportunity i'm not surprised because there are 10 episodes left uh, of this season because I was told that there's another season after this called Koda or something so yeah I thought as much that we're gonna get more after this and that we're, we're probably gonna find a way to fail but at least now we're gonna have Zuko on our side and that's gonna be interesting because I think Zuko Aang dynamic I think they're gonna become great friends that being said I ain't gonna this that my oh and the uncle and, and Toph they also had a pretty amazing relationship yeah they're, we're all getting together that, I'm calling it that being said I really really enjoyed these episodes hope you enjoyed the reactions and I'll see you in the next one stay safe love you enjoy and bye